Hi everyone. I actually want to show you the possibility of crafting uh, flux crystals and other similar stuff in applied energistics uh, without any add-ons. So for example, if you're playing as me on Fabric 1.20.1, uh, there is no add-ons that gives you a single block to craft flux crystals and you may be wondering how to do this uh, without manual work so this video is going to be useful for you um, yeah I'm gonna start with a little showcase so that's actually how it looks finished uh, we're gonna ask uh, our ME system for, I don't know, maybe 100 Vlog Crystals. I'm gonna hit start, go in here, and we see how they dropping, transforming into the Vlog Crystals. And when they finish, we're gonna see 100 Vlog Crystals in our ME system. Um, yes, so it doesn't require any kind of add-on that's just pure applied energistics here and that's basically it uh, so what we're gonna need for it uh, the most important things here is the annihilation plate and formation plate so I'm gonna show you how it should look like how you need to build it so you just need to start by uh, making a space three by four uh, by two or maybe even three if you want to enclose the water above that can be useful if you don't want to accidentally, accidentally take your items so uh, we need two kind of cables here let's say we're gonna have blue here and here that's gonna be our subnets and first side the left one I uh, need to have the formation plane here and really important is to change the mod here to to make items drop instead of be placed and after that we need to put the ME interface on this side of cable and next to the interface we need to put the pattern provider if you're playing on 1.12, uh, 20.1, if you're playing on all versions of applied energistics, uh, there is no such thing as pattern provider, only ME interfaces, but that's good, you can use them as well. They're almost identical. On opposite side, we need to place our annihilation plane, not this one. like this and we also need to put the ME storage bus here and next to it we need to put the ME interface like this we also need to connect them to our ME system and give them power supply somehow um, so it's really important to connect these two cables via quartz fiber because we do not want them to be connected to our main ME system. So it should look like this. And the interface here at the right and pattern provider at the left should be connected, must be connected to main ME system. It is also important to close the planes with any kind of facade. Uh, because items can be can go through them and it will break the after crafting in this case uh, one more thing to do is to filter the storage bus so in this case we need to put the flux crystal here this is needed to avoid the annihilation plane taking any items that it sees in front of it. So it should look like this. Uh, we need to connect it to our ME system. And 
and we need to get our pattern. So if you're wondering how a pattern should look like, it should look like this. So just one piece of Sertus Quartz, one piece of first stone Dust, one piece of Nether Quartz, and it results into the two pieces of Flux Crystal. And it should be the processing kind of pattern. So you need to put it into the pattern provider on the left side. And that's basically it. The last thing you need to drop water here. And now we can try if it works. Yep, there you go. Um, that's basically it. Uh, little remarks. Uh, it's important to have uh, like a floating water here because you just need to go into the from uh, into an elation plane. Um, it's just gonna work hundred percent. If you would uh, try to put the annihilation plane above water, like this, it will not work because the level of the water is not high enough and it also has some small gaps and there are cases where uh, flux crystal just won't get into the from, uh, into annihilation plane. So yeah, like this. So it's really important to have it like on the side. Uh, the formation plane can be anywhere. I just did it this way uh, to hide it. So all the uh, all the logistics is hidden under hidden underneath, and it just looks good. Um, yeah, that's it. Um, I didn't want to make it really precise to explain how it all works. If you're going to be interested in this, you can leave some comments and I could make a longer video explaining uh, the logic behind it, the principles, how it works. Yep. If you really like this video, please just drop the like and leave some comments. Thank you for watching, guys.